Yo, yo, what up, YouTube? Gonna be playing some King Arthur in a solo lane. The build that I'm gonna be running today is Reinforced Greaves, Stone of Gaia, Sledge, Glad Shield, Genji's Guard, and Pridewind. Reinforced Greaves is just really strong on King Arthur. I think it's the best option for him in the solo lane. Stone of Gaia gives you great sustain. Sledge is one of the best, if not the best, hybrid item in the game currently. Glad Shield, you take less damage and you deal more damage. Really strong. Genji's Guard, really good in team fights. Uh, reducing the cooldown of all your abilities by 2 seconds. Also, just giving flat cooldown reduction is really good. And Pride Win, you can use your ult multiple times in a team fight, so the shields are pretty nice. Now that we got the build out of the way, we are up against the lane bully Kukulin. He's pretty annoying. I make a pretty small mistake there. I could have basically gotten a max range 1 without him being able to return any damage. So definitely something to work on there. I do end up hitting him, that's the right thing. I should have hit those brutes though. The brute minion. Uh, just cleaved all of them. We are out clearing him as of right now. So it's pretty nice. We're going for the totem. I like putting two points into the one. Just playing more and more King Arthur. Two points into the one basically means that you do more chip damage and also you clear the wave uh, more efficiently. He ends up dodging the one there. Really nice play by him. I just three out. You can pretty much get out of Kakoan's roots with many things with King Arthur. Here Kali's trying to gank. I noticed that so I'm kind of just baiting. I do have blink. Here I don't think that I needed to use it. <laughs> but pretty much what you can do, an example of doing that, you can prep your auto attack and then blink in. You can pretty much do damage with your auto attack instantly by prepping it before blinking. As long as they're close enough. <laughs> Rama's over there calling help. It's never a good sign. Alright, yeah, now we have enough for reinforced greaves. We end up backing. I think the Colin stopped my back like once or twice, but I figured I wouldn't show it. Yeah, now we have ult. Really nice play by him, spamming his ult before he hit the ground. I miss my ult. That is by far the biggest thing I need to work on with King Arthur, is whenever enemies are super close to me, I tend to miss the, uh, the worst ult. The tier 1 ult, we'll call it. <laughs> yeah, that's why Reinforced Greaves are so strong. I'm pretty sure I would have died if I wouldn't have had those. Yeah, I didn't end up backing. I was just waiting for the wave. Figured I'd cut. And now I actually back here. Yeah, we're just clearing wave. Kakulin's kind of chilling back. A Wheelix is getting kind of fed here, which isn't the greatest thing. We do get Totem here. Super important thing to do with King Arthur is pretty much whenever your good ult is up, try to use it on the enemy. Nice, I actually hit him with that. Yeah, we're just baiting him in at this point. He should have definitely ran. I could have chased him down and killed. But it would have been really risky, so I opted to do the safer play, and luckily he came aggressive at me. But yeah, I was pretty much just playing safe, making sure I wasn't paying too much attention to the map, so I didn't know where a Wheelix was at that time. I have Tier 2 Stone of Gaia. A Wheelix gets a triple kill. I really don't like this a Wheelix either. This dude was a total D-bag whenever I played with him. K 
King Arthur is just so strong. He's one of the best uh, solo laners currently. Nuwa is ulting me. I could have killed him too. I think I fat fingered my two and I used my one instead, or tried to, but it was on a cooldown. Just a bad play by me. If I don't miss any of my abilities, you know, I kill him for free. Mistakes can be made. I am not a perfect player by any means. Here I'm trying to proxy. I just warded their jungle too, so I'm pretty safe. I figure I might as well try to fight him, but I'm kind of overstaying my welcome. I am not that fed. Oh, Wheelix is coming over. This is actually kind of huge. She dumps her blank, misses her three. Yeah, that's just huge. Now, uh, a Wheelix shared the wave with Kakolin, and she's in left side jungle doing absolutely nothing. So, pretty good. They do end up getting totem for it, so they kind of gave pressure to Kakolin, but I'll take that any day. Yeah, we're just holding on cooldown. I can't believe that that ult missed. I'm telling you, that is... I might be, like, the worst player when it comes to using that thing when they're close to me. I don't know why. Just the lunge, it just feels weird. Nice, we get a max range ult there. And he's dead. <laughs> yeah, our whole team is dead right now. They are not feeling good at all. Somebody started up a surrender vote. I said no. Yeah, it just feels bad. Our team is super good late game. And... I need to type to my team because there's one teammate who's on the fence right now. And I'm like, we can win. <laughs> Don't hit that button. Yeah, Wheelix ends up backing here. For some reason, Nuwa ulted. That was kind of weird. Yeah, Kakolin stopped my back like three times and we farmed for a bit. Now I have enough for Sledge. And I'm trying to make a rotation to boost the morale of the team. <laughs> because if I don't, things are going to start getting out of hand. Oleron ult is so OP. <laughs> Here I'm holding my thorns just so that way he commits to fighting. I should have used my one before ulting him here. Kind of a big mistake. If I miss that, um, I have to overcommit. For that rotation, they stole my blue and my tower went down. But, um, I just clear a wave here, and now I'm trying to rotate. My team's actually playing really well. I don't know why they're trying to surrender now. <laughs> or they were, because we are definitely still in this game. Yeah, a little sloppy there. Yeah, my passing could have been better running up here, but... Nice, Ra gets the kill. Good pull by Kepri. <laughs> yeah. Our team is actually so good at team fighting. Everyone's playing pretty well. We end up getting Pyromancer too. I end up farming, grab the blue, and this is the next wave that I pick up. I end up backing now. I do have Glad Shield online. I try saving Rama. 
Don't do what I'm doing right now. This is totally troll trying to chase a King Arthur. I should be over there and helping out the team. Yeah, Osiris, he just has a slow on like a three second cooldown depending what he, on what he's building. I pretty much threw that team fight there. <laughs> I missed my ult again. Oh my god, dude. Yep. Nice, we end up getting Kakoan. Yeah, I don't know why. I don't think that that ult is that hard to hit. Like the first one, I just suck. <laughs> yeah, that goes to show you. You can have a couple bad team fights, but you can still pull through. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoy the montage coming up. Let me know what you want to see next, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace. I'm trying to fight it Get in these voices inside Just stay quiet Go to the place where all this began Just start again Oh, you won't see the light Until the dawn breaks No, till it's all said and done You won't know what it takes Gotta make a wrong turn and turn around Gotta fall Get in these voices inside to stay quiet under the